Stylos. Phone lines were busy Monday morning as many customers tried to make those last minute appointments. Actually, today is our last day open. The impacts of COVID-19 have now reached the hair and beauty industry in Sarpy County. This barber shop has to cease operations starting Tuesday. It's going to kill us, especially the people that rent from me. They can't make any money. Mike Brannigan has owned the shop for more than 40 years. He says his shop was already taking steps to avoid the spread of coronavirus. We've been spacing our appointments farther apart. Um, we're wiping down the chairs between customers, of course, washing our hands. But these are guidelines that we adhere to anyway. While the measure isn't directly forcing his barbershop to close, it specifically bars the service because those providing the service, like a haircut, cannot maintain the safe six foot social distance while working on a customer. I think we're far more sanitary than your convenience stores and your, ba your gas stations. You know, I can go to one of the grocery stores and there can be a hundred people in there. At least I know my customers. But with 15 cases now reported between Sarpy and Cass counties, Health Director Sarah Schramm says additional steps are needed to slow the spread of COVID-19. Of those 15 cases, we do have five cases of community acquired illness. So we do know that COVID-19 is in our community. Brannigan says the month long closure will hurt his business. I can hang in there for a month or two, you know, but after that, I don't know what's going to happen. Now, beauty salons and nail salons, as well as massage therapy shops and tattoo parlors will also have to cease operations due to those new uh, directed health measures. You can find more specific details and information about the directed health measure for Sarpy Cast County on our website, 3newsnow.com. Reporting live from La Vista, Sydney Gray, 3 News Now.